Hi there, I'm Dwayne McKay. I'm the uh, president, uh, new president actually. I've been president for three months of the Florida Institute of Technology over in Melbourne, Florida. The Florida Institute of Technology is uh, really only 58 years old. It started with NASA. It's the only independent technical university in the southern United States about 5,500 students on campus, another 1,500 on a number of sites up and down the East Coast, and about 3,000 online. It's predominantly engineering. Half of the on-campus students are engineering students, another quarter are science students, although we do offer a variety of other degrees, including communications, psychology, a business school that's focused on entrepreneurial engineering, and aeronautics, one of the few schools in the country that has a, a full up program for not only educating aeronautics professionals but also training pilots. An interesting thing about our school is the fact that I call us a blue collar university and almost everyone takes issue with that because the people that leave our school get wonderful white collar jobs. In fact, uh, we pride ourselves that year after year after year somewhere between 94 and 98 percent of the students that graduate immediately go to work in their field of choice or go to graduate school. That's one of the uh, focal points of what we do and that is educating students for a lifetime. One of the decisions we made about 12, 13 years ago was to grow our international population. Uh, that's pretty common now, but uh, 13 years ago it wasn't. Uh, we were less than 10 percent international students. We knew that we had great international appeal all over Asia, the Middle East, South America. So we made it a deliberate decision to grow our international population. We're now the number one internationalized doctoral university in the United States. About a third of our students, undergraduates, are international students. Fifty-seven or so percent of our graduate students are international students. We're known all over the world. Uh, students from 123 countries, and they're studying the same thing as the domestic students, primarily engineering and science, uh, but with a pretty uh, healthy helping of, of business students. You know, as taking over as a new president, I have a great advantage, and that is the fact that we have tremendous momentum that's been built by the last uh, couple of administrations. One of the biggest goals is to keep that momentum going, and we're doing that in a, a little bit different fashion, and that is rather than continue to spread out and grow, we're going to focus down and deepen. And so we're choosing a handful of areas that we're not only going to be good in, we're going to be as good as anybody. I call it good to great. It's going to be a real focused endeavor in our university to be as good as anyone in five or six areas within the school.